Hey skiers, it's Bob with SkiEssentials.com. Welcome to our 2022 ski test. Got a fun one for you today. This is the K2 Reckoner 112. This is the second year of this ski. We get a graphics refresh for this year. Uh, still that really fun free ride ski, uh, twin tip freestyle influence. Uh, this whole Reckoner line is all about having fun in soft snow. Uh, this one being kind of the, the middle of the pack. There's a 92, 102, 112, and 122. Um, this one is just a really well-rounded free ride ski, uh, has a lot more capabilities than you might think given the width, um, but still just a really fun overall ski. Uh, starting with the construction, we get a double barrel core of fir and aspen, a nice blend of wood. We also get their carbon boost braid as well as their carbon spectral braid. So the carbon spectral braid is the thing that really makes this ski stand out. Um, by inlaying carbon stringers, uh, they are more vertical in the tips and tails and then more horizontal in the underfoot zone. So that gives this area more torsional stiffness and edge hold. And then the shovel and through the tail here with that longer, uh, longer braid shape um, does make the ski more maneuverable uh, and just a little bit more flexible. But with that carbon in there, it does still uh, give it good stiffness. It allows the nice engineers at K2 to fine tune the torsional and longitudinal flex of the ski. And like these other Reckoners, we do see this pretty nice even flex to it as well. Um, great for soft snow. Uh, you might think that a ski that soft wouldn't carve. And what it really does though is it allows you to access uh, the, full, the full side cut, which is great. Uh, making this thing leave some of the cleanest and roundest turns of any ski at this at this shape. You know, you get something like this with a bunch of metal in it, and it's really hard to make all that material bend, especially at slower or more moderate speeds. 22.9 um, meter turn radius in this 184, so a little bit longer. We're looking to get a little bit more speed on this ski, more stability in a straighter line. Um, and then in addition to that carbon braid, uh, Really where we see this ski set itself apart is in the uh, rocker profile and taper shape. So we still got nice good positive camber underfoot, uh, but we're going to see a lot of rocker in the profile. Starting down here, pretty low. You know, it's gradual pretty much the whole way up. For as long as the rocker is, this is still not too dramatic of a splay. Um, and then in terms of the taper, we do see that widest part of the ski uh, come down to about here. So this whole part up here pretty much isn't touching the snow until it gets soft. That means that this thing is super smooth, easy to turn, very surfy, smeary, free ridey, drifty, all of those nice adjectives that all equal uh, fun time in soft snow. We see a pretty similar profile and taper in the tail. It's not, uh, it's not symmetrical, um, but it is similar, just on that narrower, narrower end of the spectrum. So rocker starts down here, very gradual, moderate splay for how long the rocker is. And then for profile, um, sorry, taper, you know, we do see that widest part come down to about here. So this tail here, really very surfy, easy to do wheelies, easy to stay back, have fun, make some tail side turns. Just a great overall shape and profile for soft snow. Uh, and at 112 underfoot, uh, you're gonna stay on top of a whole lot, of, whole lot of depth. So not a whole lot of worries in terms of getting submerged on this thing. Gonna stay on top, gonna float really well. Surprisingly agile uh, and well-versed when you're getting back to the lift. Um, you know, and, and pretty, pretty light as well. So that use of carbon does you know, make the ski behave like something with more substance to it, but the light is pretty, uh, the lightweight is pretty impressive. Uh, so that's it, that is the K2 Reckoner 112. Super fun free ride ski from K2. Check this thing out at skiessentials.com and we will see you out there on the hill. Bye.